oh boy why is this world coming to right this is my 397 speaking about this this video that I've just been sent by my friend I log into Facebook my friend says I think you need to see this video and give your thoughts and opinions on on this video that you've seen right this this video is about this Asian guy and he's walking from behind a school I think it was and these seven dudes have just randomly started kicking the crap out of this guy right and it's I'll put a link in but you know the it's bad right okay for starters this guy he didn't do nothing as far as anyone else is concerned or anyone else has seen doing nothing this guy's just started filming the original video has actually been taken down off of YouTube because the guy that filmed it would have been means that he would have been there so they would have been able to catch him so for obvious reasons but people have just copied it anyway my thoughts and opinions these seven dudes then they need to be caught one of them's already been caught already I think by Chicago police or whatever I think someone's already caught them but yeah I just I just don't understand mentally why you feel the need to do this to a certain individual now there's people that are out there that they 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 they're in prison, they abuse children, white supremacists that are racist. There's all these other people. There's you know just, I don't know people that murder people for no reason, like serial killers. All of them people that you could go and pick on, but no, you choose to pick on one innocent, helpless Asian man. What's wrong with you? Seriously, you people that done this, right? You go and get some slapping when you go to prison. When you get caught, people are going to beat you and you're going to know how it feels, right? Because I tell you now, I tell you now, you're not going to get away with this. Because the way this video is going around the net, man, you go and get caught and you go and get slapped. And you're going to know how it feels when it's your ass being kicked out, yeah? So just check this out, right? So for starters, next time, this goes out to everyone. Everyone, all them people that think they're hard and think they're cool and think they're big for starting or someone. So someone that doesn't even know. I know it's funny, the guy didn't do nothing, yeah? His English wasn't even very good. He's, he's Chinese. His English wasn't even good. He was saying, no more, stop, no more beating, no more beating. But no, you carry on. Are you serious? Balls in your mouth, my, my dad. Now, it's just, oh, mate, I don't even know what to say is disturbing it's not good it's disturbing that people can actually do this that can actually do this to another human being right that actually beat the crap out of him so bad yeah that his face i'm surprised he ain't dead you know and eventually towards the end of the video he managed to get up and leg it and get the hell out of there but his face yeah, was bleeding and the way they was kicking him in his face the way they was punching him in his face the way they was slapping him the way they was pushing him picking him up and throwing him down to the ground are you serious? are you serious? it's just like you know I don't even I don't even know what to how to even put this into words because it's just it's bad it's bad I told you I'll put the link in I put the link in, but this is just this is just crazy. So just you know, I don't know. But for anyone who's out there that maybe does know information, I don't know how far this video is going to get if it goes around the world. But anyone that has any information, then just you know, just tell the police. But oh, this is it's deep. It's deep, man. It's deep. You know. It's just like. How? I don't I don't get it. I can't physically, mentally get it in my brain that you can be so violent. What? Uh, just a violent... Do you, do you know what? Do you know if I was... If it's down to me, down to me in the court, I'd get them all lined up here. Every time they'll speak, I'll be like, BAM! One for you. Yeah, are you speaking? BAM! One for you, yeah? That's what I'll be doing. I'll slap them down, say where they slap that guy down. But, you know, that's, that's in, a, in, a, in a world... But violence isn't the answer, I suppose. And I've learnt that. Violence isn't the answer. I've learnt that. But seriously, you people, the people that do this, yeah? There's even people here in England, right, that do this. And they think they're cool and they think they're big. They're attacking helpless people. Why? Attack people that need to be... If you're going to attack someone, you go down to the you go down to the ghetto, yeah? If you, these people there from Chicago, you go down to... You go down to places... In, in America, which are, which is the ghetto where the people hard, you go and attack some of them big ass 
black dudes, right? You take these big black dudes, yeah, they got muscles, they got tattoos, you go and attack one of them and see what happens to you, yeah? But oh no, because you're too, you're too chicken, you know, you can't, you can't attack people your own size, you've got to attack someone helpless, yeah? But you go and start on one of them, but yeah, when the police catch you, yeah, when the police catch you people, you go to prison, and you're going to get the same bitch slaps that you give to that guy. You're going to get it slapped down the same way, yeah? So, that's my views. You guys are going to prison. You go and get caught, yeah? But the people that do this, it's not cool. You know, you don't look cool. You don't look big. You don't look hard. You don't look whatever you're trying to prove, whatever point you're trying to do. It just makes you look stupid, and you've got nothing better to do, yeah, with your time apart from picking helpless people. But when you go to court, I would they give you life imprisonment, yeah? And then you're going to get, you're going to get, to get all bad things happening to you because you deserve it. You deserve everything that comes to you. You think you're getting away with this, you ain't. You think you're getting away with this, but you won't. But, boy, this world, this world, this world, it's not good. What this world's coming to. But, anyway, oh, this is not. But, and then, oh, he just, and I didn't even get it. Why do you, oh, as I keep saying, why do you pick on him, man? You look at the video, and he's the most weediest guy you can see. The most skinniest weed, he's just a weedy Chinese, man. He's not like some big old, big ass, big bruise of a bloke. He's some weedy guy, he's like the weediest guy ever, you know, and you go and beat him down. What, why, why, what, I don't get it, I don't get it. Balls in your mouth, man. Balls in your mouth. Because I don't get it. Why? The most weediest guy you choose to pick on. Because you're too chicken to start on people. But as I keep telling you, you go down you go down to the ghetto, and you go down to the slums, and you go down to places where there are gangsters, and they'll shoot you, and they'll break their forth in your ass, yeah? That's what they'll do to you. <sighs> anyway, let's pass the video around. And you know, let's help them catch. But as I said, one of them got caught. And because they're so chicken, that's what they'll do. Once one gets caught, they'll grass on everyone else. And then they'll all go down. So then we'll see. But you start on people your own size. You start on people bigger than you. And then you see what happens to you. Because your just desserts is coming. You ain't getting away with this. You ain't getting away with this. No way. My 397. I'm out.